how does it create energy? I don't understand that. It's liquid. It's supposed to be, you know, people think of water as nothing. Yeah. You know, and it is a lot of not nothing, <laughs> but it is, it is not nothing. It is the essential of life. But why do you, you say you get energy from it? Um, water, all, all elements on the earth are made of cations and anions, okay? Yeah. And they're like magnets. You think magnets will create energy, correct? Mm -hmm. um, a comment about that, uh, as it travels through your system, it hydrates all those systems of your body. Every single your body function is affected. <clears throat> a major problem in this pH thing, and this is re the primary reason I developed this product. I heard about a product that increased the pH, and I heard they were selling it for $5,000. Mm -hmm. I said, what am I, what am I doing it's wrong? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, <clears throat> so I looked into it, and I found out it was a product using a process called ionization. Mm -hmm. So I started to check out ionization to see what it was. And what ionization is somewhat like an electric chair. You know, imagine an electric chair, and mm -hmm. how do you think this person in the electric chair is going to be affected by what gets plugged <coughs> in the wall? He's going right? to die. He's going to die. He's going to die. So these things are plugged in the wall, and they create uh, ionization, uh, ionization in the fact that the energy is transferred to a plate, usually made out of titanium or some other material, okay? And that, and that creates heat, okay? It separates the cell, and thereby raising the pH. It only lasts for less than two days. They say 24 hours, but, but I'm sure of that, okay? Because I've <sighs> tested it. So can you imagine this thing? And guess what they don't do, Jim? The real big deal. You know, our earth now and our water now are all, is all contaminated, all. Mm -hmm. So there are all those contaminants. You know, you, you've heard me say A, B, C, D, E and all those letters because mm -hmm. I can remember mm -hmm. they, mm -hmm. the acidic contaminants, the chemical contaminants, the um, inorganic mineral contaminants, the radiological contaminants, and now the pH in this process is a contaminant in my opinion. O only because you can't assimilate it. Your body can't, so they call it dead water. And I, wow. so I think it's a joke. So I said, well, maybe I can come up with something.